Craig Kristen, 9-11 was 18 years ago. That means the vast majority of high schoolers weren't even born yet. But that doesn't mean today doesn't hold special meaning to them. I was in third grade because I was eight years old. Many recall the exact details of where they were and what they were doing on September 11th, 2001. Uh, my parents were just like on the phone, just talking to their relatives, and it was just like this moment of just kind of like, what is going on in the world? That was 18 years ago. While many Americans will never forget, there's a whole new generation who doesn't remember. I don't really know anything about the 9-11. I wasn't really born yet. I was not born yet. I wasn't born. I was negative too. No, I wasn't even alive yet. For the overwhelming majority of local students, they learned about 9-11 in a textbook. Yeah, I had a few teachers explain where they were, what they were doing exactly, and you know, how it just kind of just popped up and it was just a huge tragedy. Uh, my math teacher brought it up and she said that her brother actually enlisted in the Navy because of it. But just because they don't recall 9-11 doesn't mean the importance of the day is lost on them. Pretty important day to come back, think about and try to prevent whatever caused it to never happen again. And honor those who served our country. But it's just like remembering everyone that serves for us and how our country bounced back from it. Beginning today, the U.S. military will now accept service members who weren't even alive when the attacks happened on the morning of September 11th, 2001. Live in studio, Anna Weeks, NBC5 News.